Hello artists, my name is Jake and today I'll be demonstrating a handful of the many new features you can find now in the new Clip Studio Paint 2.0. To start, we'll go over a couple of the new improved quality of life features. First and foremost is the new background saving feature. Though we all know it's important to save, the interruption of waiting for autosave or manual save to complete can get intrusive especially if you've been working on a larger canvas. But with the help of a background save feature enabled, you can keep working while the program saves your files. To turn it on, go to File, Preferences, or press Ctrl K. Then you can find Save and Recovery options under the File tab. Under Save, make sure you check mark Save Files as Background Process, then press OK and you're rearing to go. You'll know it's working when you see this symbol in your file name. Alternatively, for a clearer indicator, you can also enable the option Show Save Status as Pop-Up, and a message will pop up during the save process. The next quality of life feature is that you can now search your layers. It's easy to lose track of layers, particularly when we're prone to using so many of them. There is now a keyword search function added to the search layer window, so now you benefit even more from naming your layers. 2.0 also comes with an array of new text features that improve upon the text tool. It now comes with a new drag operation and selection mode for the text tool property. Textbox creation has now been implemented under this tool. By enabling this, you can now use the text tool to click and drag text boxes however big or small you want, and it even comes with word wrap support automatically breaking lines legibly and authentically to fit any box you create. From the drop-down menu, you can now also use this tool to select multiple text boxes and create bulk changes all at once, from font size to font style. Coming from a previous version of Clip Studio? Worry not. 2.0 comes with backwards compatibility. If you come from a version as early as 1.13.2, you can enable this by going into the Text Tool Property window, then selecting your version in the Compatibility tab drop-down menu. Clip Studio Paint 2.0 has also made improvements upon its 3D features. Managing 3D figures can be difficult, especially for artists new to Clip Studio. For ease of access, you can now create a new 3D layer with model figures by going to the Layer, New Layer, 3D drawing figure. A new menu appears, giving you the option to pick a figure and then pick a pose, which can all be found in your materials folder. There are also new 3D tools available to enhance your 2.0 experience. You can now swap the sex of your 3D model at any time, even after posing and shaping the body. You can do so by opening the Object Subtool Detail window and selecting the 3D drawing figure tab and the options can be found at the top. This works for downloaded models as well. The program also comes with a new adjustable 3D head model material with face mixing technology. It comes with a variety of adjustment sliders, letting you mix different face style sliders and even adjust specific facial features to your heart's content. To avoid any distortion from face mixing, you can enable Limit Face Mixer to make the blend looks much more natural. The drawing figures aren't the only ones getting special treatment. 3D scenes have also come with new features. You can now create distance fog in your 3D environment, helping to establish depth and mood. Distance fog can be enabled by going to your environment subtool detail and select fog and check mark enable fog. You can then adjust the fog distance, depth, and even color. On top of this, this subtool now comes with the ability to now apply two-point perspective to your 3D layers with the Straighten feature. You can find this by going to Subtool Detail and Lens and Straighten under Vertical Perspective. One click and your scene will revert from three-point to two-point perspective, making this extremely helpful in reducing the warp from camera adjustments getting that perfect angle. This is but a handful of the new features found in Clip Studio 2.0. There's also a new and improved liquify tool, fisheye lens ruler, geometric distortion, shade assist, panorama, and many more. 
Hope you enjoy this next era of Clip Studio.